Hello, my name is Anabin and uh, today I would like to show you how to implement uh, streaming with uh, JSON and JAXRS2. So it will require Java 7. I was recently asked uh, during the Java user group meeting in Warsaw about this. And uh, so I would like to show you how to implement this. It's actually very nice with Java 7. So I will start with Maven project, which is the simplest one. And um, I would call this uh, JSON streaming, streaming, and I would like to keep it um, uh, realistic. So I would like to implement the uh, resource and a boundary, and the resource will uh, ask the boundary to stream and return the JSON stream to the client. So to start, we will have to implement uh, the configuration, the JAXRS configuration, RS config configuration and uh, the package is streaming streaming is also nice but streaming so um, and it implements the application path not implements is annotated with application path and I will call the um, path streams and it has to extend from um, JAX yeah, by X, uh, WSRS application. Now, um, JAXRS is configured, so what we also need is the um, JSON streamer, which can be actually an EJB. This, is, uh, this would be the boundary, and I would like to implement a method stream with output stream. And what we can do here is first ask the um, method JSON to create a generator. This is actually the gen, the right uh, name. And the generator now we um, um, is um, supports streaming. So what we have to do is to uh, write to decide whether you would like to stream an object or an array. And I would like to create an object. Uh, JSON object, and here we can we have to write the end of the object, and also flush the generator, and also close the generator. So, and here, because I'm lazy, I would like just to create a loop, which creates thousand entries. And I would use the generator dot write method, and it creates a key and a value. Yes. So a key and a value looks good. So we started the object, we write the end, and we flash and close. So now our business logic. Is, is ready to go. Of course, we could use uh, try with resources, but it um, actually doesn't matter right now. So um, I would like to create the resource right now. Streams resource is the JAXRS class. And this can be EJB again. Usually I like to make it EJB because of monitoring purposes. So I will see actually what happens on the server. If there is not an EJB, it would be more or less a blind, blind flight. So. Um, there is a streams. Uh, I would like to return a response. Streams. And the method is, uh, I will call it get. So, get response. So, what it can do is to say return response.ok, for instance, build. So, it will just create, um, generate uh, HTTP 200 code. What we actually would like to do is to return a stream here and there is a really nice helper class in JAXRS called streaming output and the um, streaming output has to be implemented you could use lambda expressions of course for this and uh, what we can do here invoke our EGB so let's do it JSON streamer JS, nice name, add inject. 
and uh, here we can just say stream and then we can return as a body the streaming output we could achieve um, the same with message body writer but streaming output is a lot easier to handle so again i could just convert this to a lambda expression but um, i would say this is not a point of of this presentation so um let's build this and run it on glassfish so um, now everything compiles and uh, deploys on Glassfish. Glassfish starts behind the scenes and it should open the browser, yes. Um, and w I think I used the resources path in the JAXRS configuration plus streams. Did I? JAXRS configuration? Ah, completely wrong. So it was a mistake, but let's do it. Streams, 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 streams. As you can see, we, is a, we are able to stream 1,000 entries directly to the browser. So um, this, of course, I would call that rather resources, not streams. This was a mistake. So um, thank you for watching. And uh, it is... I think uh, JaxRS and uh, JSON are really nice APIs which are coming with Java 7. And uh, see you on, at one of upcoming conferences, workshops, or even AirHacks, the um, Java workshop at Munich Airport. So thank you.